Hello world, I'm LJ and this is LJ Goes Sweden. Today I am sitting on my couch, it is no time for any react. I just feel like nah, I don't have anything, I didn't feel like looking through anything right now. So yeah, I will be just talking about my daily life as in the good old times. Well, so it is Wednesday and tomorrow is the national day in Sweden, so it's a holiday. Unfortunately, I have to work on Friday this time. The last few times we had a holiday on a first day, we always got the Friday off, but this time it is not the case. Well, it's not too bad because it's just one day before we have weekends. So what happened today at work, basically, yeah, same as usual, working on some documents. Then also, yeah, trying to do some practical things in between that it's not getting too boring. We also had some, yeah, monthly meetings. But actually, my workday is not finished for today. I will have a meeting later today with some people. I guess it's in America. That's why they chose this late time. So, of course, I cannot talk with you about anything. But, yeah, another hour having a meeting. We will see how it goes. You also had to leave earlier today at work because there was also something going on that yeah, basically needed all the people to get out of the building. And besides that, I was dealing today with getting my medication. Yesterday, I told you that I finally have the recipe for my Cosentix after talking to the assistant of the doctor multiple times. But because I knew that there is no chance that they will have it in store in any Swedish pharmacy or like at least not in my area. I thought like, okay, I will call them so that they can already order it, which is then good because if someone from work or my landlord drives me to the pharmacy, I can just pick it up instead of driving there twice. So I called them. I actually ended up in the basically the hotline, but there was one crazy thing when I was in the hotline that I've never seen before. In Sweden, we are using this bank ID thing where you can basically scan any QR code on any yeah, website to make contracts, sign them or log into things where they store your data. And I have used this app, this bank ID app to verify myself during this hotline conversation. So basically there was like this automated voice telling me, hey, type in your person number and then open your bank ID and verify yourself. And I did it and it worked. And I was really, really not expecting this because usually you have to scan something in, in the bank ID first. But the app knew somehow that I'm in this conversation. It's amazing. So, and then I talked to this person and yeah, I also asked him like, hey, can in the future, can I order it myself? Because I know you can order your medication yourself. But he said, like, talk to the person in the pharmacy because I don't know how they will be doing it, for example, with those cooling ejection things. So I will do that. And unfortunately, though, I still don't have the medication. The guy told me, yes, it will be here the next day. But because we have this holiday tomorrow, it's going to be Friday. So on Friday, I will be picking up my medication. I also already checked how much I'm going to pay. And it is luckily the high cost protection limit. So those 250 something euros, which is of course still a lot of money to just pay at once. But I know it's basically yeah, nothing in the future for the next 11 and a half months. <sighs> so I'm, I'm, I'm happy with that. Yes, and that is my current situation. I also have another phone call after this work meeting today with a friend of mine. And then I will just be chilling and hoping to have a nice, relaxing day tomorrow, holiday. I have not planned anything. I, I was really, really hoping to finally fix the deal on the Tesla because it is basically already a fixed deal. But my money has not arrived in Sweden yet. So, yeah, I hope it's going to be on Friday because, of course, tomorrow the banks are also not working. But if it's on Friday, then I will probably yeah, take all the time on the weekend to make it possible. So that was it for today. I hope you had a wonderful Friday for you guys. And I wish you the best weekend you can have. Enjoy the weather if it's nice or take some time off if it's raining. Well, we're going to see each other back in tomorrow's video. Have a good one. Bye bye.